Hey there guys, how's it going? This is Rex over here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys something that I recently found out that I thought was really cool, um, that I basically learned from one of my friends who recently tried it out and told me it worked and told me how he did it and all, and basically what that is, is using a wired Xbox 360 controller uh, coupled with your Xbox 360 wired mic, and basically uh, utilizing the plug and play feature on Windows based machines um, by basically plugging in um, your wired controller via USB slot, and uh, using your mic plugged into your controller as basically a headset to do just whatever you want to do on your computer. Basically you can record or talk or whatever with your Xbox mic um, coupled with your controller. So that was actually really cool and I never knew you could actually do that until he told me about it. So pretty much what I'm going to show you guys is just that. How to basically use an Xbox 360 wired mic um, on your computer using um, an Xbox 360 wired controller. So let's go ahead and get this thing started here. Ugh, wake up my computer. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and firstly take our uh, controller here and take the little USB. And is it? Yes it is. <laughs> Wrapped around the edge there. Alright, so let's try this again. Or try this again. <laughs> A little tired, guys. If you didn't notice or didn't notice, I'm not even going to try anymore. All right, so we have our uh, USB end of our wired controller. We're going to go ahead and plug it into one of our USB slots on our computer. And usually, what will happen is uh, if this is your first time ever plugging in a USB controller, uh, especially a um, Xbox 360 controller, or I guess it really doesn't matter. But um, mine is, uh, for example, a Mad Cat's. Uh, so. <clears throat> Usually what will happen is right about somewhere around here, um, <laughs> uh, there will be a little thing that says installing drivers needed to uh, like run the software or whatever, or run the hardware I suppose, uh, that's being plugged into this computer. And uh, basically it's just configuring Windows to be able to uh, take this controller and be able to use it. And uh, what we're going to go and do now is, because I've already uh, done that and set up the drivers and whatnot, uh, I guess really not set them up, you don't really need to do anything, just kind of <laughs> wait about five minutes uh, for it to load, depending on your machine. Uh, but what we want to go and do next is plug in your mic to your uh, the back of your controller. Push, plug in the jack to your slot. There we go. Alright, and uh, now you're pretty much good to go actually, believe it or not. Um, what you want to go ahead and do though, just if you want to go ahead and test this, uh, you can go ahead and go to the start menu and load up sound recorder on your uh, machine. You should have it already installed if you're using Windows 7. Uh, if you can't find it, just go ahead and go to the start menu and type in sound. Uh, do, 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 sound, it's kind of hard to type with one hand. Uh, but sound and you get sound recorder at the very top right there under programs. And just go ahead and click on that. There we go, and let me go and unplug my uh, Skull Candy uh, headphones there. Alright, so what you want to go ahead and do next is, here's what I had to do, because at first when I did this, I had a bit of a problem. And uh, that problem being, uh, my, basically, um, my headset wasn't set as a default recording device, and, or device, excuse me. And that was kind of putting everything out of whack. My, my computer was just like, ah, oh, what's going on? And so what you have to go ahead and do, if basically it's not working for you, and you can't record stuff, is go ahead and, and you also, you'll know if you're recording stuff, if uh, you start talking to the mic, just like randomly saying, stuff like I'm saying stuff right here and it can still pick it up um, so if you're saying stuff this little green right here hello see how it just kind of picked up that green uh, that basically shows that it's picking up audio so what you want to go ahead and do <clears throat> if it's not doing that is go over here to where your sound settings are right click and go to playback and devices all right and go ahead and hop over to the recording and uh, right where it says headset microphone, and it should say the name of your controller or whatever uh, you happen to be using right underneath, uh, go ahead and right click on that. And you want to go ahead and, <clears throat> excuse me, set as default device. Now, mine already is set like that, so I don't really need to do that. Um, but usually what you need to do is just set as default device. All right, and of course you can uncheck that when it's done, but you know, whatever you want to do. And then once you're done, just go ahead and hit start record. And hello. That was a little loud. Let's go ahead and hit stop record. And do, 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 do. save it as untitled, sure. And go ahead and play it. And hello. 
<laughs> not the best of quality, but still exceptional in my book, at least for, you know, starting microphone or if it's your only option or whatever. So, anyway, guys, I'm running out of battery, so that's going to be it for now. No snazzy intros or whatever, outros, excuse me. Uh, that's pretty much the end of this video. Just wanted to show you guys that because I thought it was pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, enjoy it. <laughs> so, with that said, guys, this has been Rex Furry, and as always, I'll see you all next video.